Hello and welcome back everybody. I am Lainey and we are back on our 7 Days to Die Madness series. I have my whole garden to collect, but you can see we're at day 34 after a week of building. That was absolutely spectacular. We have level 1 at least of our cake complete. And I thought today since it's most of the day is gone as you can see, I would take it easy and I would build some fun things. Now the first thing I want to do though is gather this up really quickly before I take off. And then after this, I am going to go and I'm going to find some cars. Basically what I want to do today is I want to build not only our gyrocopter, which is one of the recipes that we got last time, but we also have the ability to make the 4x4, we have the ability to make the rocket launcher. So yes, it might seem slightly ambitious to get all of this done in one day. But I do have a lot of stuff already to make them, including the forged steel, which I think might be the most expensive part, that and the engines. Uh, the only thing I'm a little bit concerned about is obviously not having enough engines, so that's why I want to go ahead and get more. I have one here, I think I bought this from the trader, I can go and see if the trader will sell me another one, but I don't want to use all the ones that I have already, because I do have a lot of things here that I need to operate, I probably want to get another one of those. But even if I don't, I want to put more electrical in our horde base. And just more electrical in general. It's really dark in there. <laughs> and I just want to make some stuff. So today we're crafting. We're crafting, crafting. You can see that we have a nice amount of forged steel made already. There's 120 something more making there. We have a little bit of forged iron. I think this should be enough. And let me put this away. We already have the gyrocopter accessories. The only thing we should put to make before we take off is just all the wheels. The gyro, I believe, needs three, and the 4x4 four four obviously needs four. Clearly. <laughs> By name. So we're going to get these going right away. Are we going to leave it running? Maybe we'll even put a part of the 4x4 four four to make. We'll see. And then we'll return. We'll go to Jen. We'll go to a car lot or something and just have a little bit of fun before nighttime. Or during nighttime. TBD. Okay, so I grabbed a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's start with the wheels, as I had previously said. So I'm going to need four plus three. That's going to be seven wheels. Craft. We'll get the accessories going for the truck. So that will be going there as well. Yeah, it's fine. I'll be gone for a while, so it's not going to matter. You can see that I did find a ton of engines. I found the rocket launcher parts. I think we're set on everything except duct tape. So I'm making a ton of this right now. And we're probably going to have to go fill up the jars as well as maybe get more engines. I know it looks like we have them. We do. So I can put them to make at least before we leave. But ugh, there's still so much to do. Here I'm making some wheels. We've put seven to make as well as I'm making the 4x4 accessories. The 4x4 chassis is what's going to take a whole lot of duct tape. So let's put some duct tape here to make. I think that would be a little bit more reasonable. 37. Very good. That's not going to be enough either. But it's going to get us closer. That's for sure. Look, I have so many bones. It's just a matter of going to get some water. But I want to leave as much stuff making as I can before I actually leave. So let's put this all in the same one just to make sure that I am sort of... I need two more. Easy, easy. Oh, I'm so pleased. And that's it. With that, in a few minutes, we'll have a 4x4 truck. One has been checked. I know I have lead car batteries. I'm not really worried about that. And let's see what we need for the rocket launcher, because I think that's the only other thing that I wanted so, so badly. Uh, we're going to need more duct tape. Perfect. And there we go. We can craft that as well. Five minutes in our rocket launcher. I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased. We even have a couple of extra rocket parts. I don't think we're going to need to make another one. I I'm going to be just okay with this one. But for the next coordinate, we're going to have it. So I am very, very excited. Let's grab the glue. Just keep making duct tape. Keep making duct tape. Okay, while that makes, let's get out of here and let's go find a body of water. I think that's basically plan A over here. And then tonight, I guess we could start working on the moat or we could go try out the rocket launcher. Which I think, guys, might be an idea over there. I haven't made any ammo. I'll have to come back for that. But let's find some water first. Okay, this is not too far. Easy, actually. Let's go fill up all our jars over there. I was going to go to Jen to see if she had a vehicle, but I don't think I need to. I don't even know if I brought my wrench. I did not. I'm going to have to go back home for that. But I do plan to at least wrench everything around here. Okay. Here we go. It's this motel. 
easy enough. Oh, there's gonna be so many zombies here. Yeah. It's still early. It's still early. Don't look at me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Good. Oh. Shen's closed. Leave me alone, men. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm going home. I'm going home. 292? It actually used up all of it? Oh, that's crazy. Okay, we'll go to... We'll go higher. Oh, my only concern with this is that I kind of wanted a little bit of water. And I just used all my jars. I guess I can make new jars later. That's fine. The glue is more important, that's for sure. My rocket launcher, finally. Ah, uh, let's make some rockets, right? Oh, I am gonna need more stuff than this to make rockets, but that's fine. We need buckshot, I already have it made. Gunpowder, duct tape, well, 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 we we're making some. Gas, I definitely have, and the rocket casing. I'm gonna have to make some of these, I think. I might have a few, but not a whole lot. All right, let's get this together. I want to at least get 10 rockets tonight and see what we can do, you know? It doesn't have to be much. One good explosion is all I ask for. Just one. Okay, rockets. I can make four. I need more box shot. Look, four rockets. It's fine. I wanted ten. But obviously I need to make more box shot. I have enough casings. That's something. I can't even make any. I am so out of lead. We've made so many, so many bulletproof glass. No, no, no. I have to focus on the forged iron over here, the forged steel. And I, don't, I can't focus on box shot right now. So four. That's all we're getting. That's okay, I'm fine with that. Just keep making that, keep burning, burn, burn, burn. And we'll have enough for the gyro very, very soon. But at the very least, guys, we have the 4x4. Four four. It is made. It is here. Oh, my beautiful vehicle. And we have the rocket launcher. Look, it cannot be going any better if we tried. We are, we're going to have four whole rockets. Look, at least we're going to be able to use it. Positives everywhere. And I think that's, that's good. I will go somewhere because we are going to explode these rockets tonight. I know it would be wise to maybe wait for Fortnite, but me, sensible, no, 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 not today. Let's get this going. Oh, finally. Okay. <laughs> Three minutes and we'll have the chassis and then that's it, right? We should have everything, everything. Perfect. And we'll have a gyro today as well. Oh, I am so happy. Let me put away all the other stuff. I don't need anything but the wheels now and the battery and all that. And then we'll get that going. I'll put out the car as soon as I can. And then I was wondering, where is... Do I have a... I don't think I have an impact driver. If I do, that would be amazing. But at least I need to pick up my ratchet. Because we need to go out and we need to find more engines. I plan to really rework the electrical. And uh, I guess maybe we'll start installing it tonight. If we don't go and grab a, a little bit of excitement. Well, we, we, we do want to at least kill a zombie tonight. We'll be trying out the marksman rifle. Just a little bit. I prefer the sniper one. But maybe this will do. And what this is going to do is it's, it's going to give us a larger magazine. Instead of one shot, we'll get a few. It, it might be more usable, I think. Even though it'll do less damage. I don't know if it's going to one shot things. But, you know, we have a nice spec. It's definitely possible. Oh, and speaking of our spec, guys, since I'm sitting here, we have 16 points to spend. I was going to ask you guys what do you wanted to spend them on, basically. We have a few options here, but I think I'm actually going to go crazy and I'm just going to put all the points into perception. I know this may be a little bit crazy, but I really, really want to get this. I could just not get level 10 and use the glasses. But I do like to use either the lucky goggles or the intellect goggles so I don't have to put more points into any other spec. So since this is my spec, I'm going to go for it. And we're just going to go 10 out of 10. This might also give me an achievement because I don't know if I've ever been 10 out of 10 perception. But I am pleased. We're also going to start investing in the Javelin Master. I've been saying it for a long time. Eventually, we'll make a better spear. And this is going to help. So I'm going to go for it. Here we go. It almost hurts, but we're doing it. We're also going to go full-on Demolitions Expert and full-on Deadeye. That's it. Now we have only one point available. And there's a couple of options, right? We could go Penetrator. Just go full Penetrator. You do Animal Tracker. The Infiltrator would be interesting if we're able to... Well, not the damage from landmines, but if we're able to pick up the landmines, that would be kind of nice. And 
I think it's only three points, so it might be... Yeah, it might be worth. Maybe. We could do Lucky Looter. We could do a little bit more Salvage Operations. Uh, overall, with the amount of stuff that we Ratchet and Wrench, maybe this would be a better idea than Lucky Looter. But Lucky Looter would also be pretty cool if we can upgrade some of these things. Uh, I know the bonus loot isn't incredible, but the, f the looting um, speed is excellent. Another thing that I wanted to do is maybe invest another point into Sexual Tyrannosaurus, but this requires Strength 5. I think I still would rather do this. So we're going to go up. This would also give us more mining traits. So, you know, this is going to be the our second skill set, I guess. It's going to be Perception, Strength, and a little bit of Agility. We don't have any more points. It's over. Soon TM. Soon TM, we'll get more. But uh, I think, what are we waiting for here? Nothing, nothing. Just putting this to make. And there he goes. Our gyro will be done in three minutes. Exceptional. You know what? I'm going to leave this here because we're not going to take it yet. We'll look at all of those in the morning. For now, I'm going to take the miserable amount of rockets that I have. And let's go bow something up. I'm scared. All right. I am terrified. We're going to switch to these. Does it originally come with one? It does not. We'll put our lucky goggles on. We'll probably leave those here in our little gear box. This is like all our old gear that I don't know what to do with. <laughs> so just leaving it there for now until I decide. And then uh, we're taking off. Uh, where's my bicycle? Back here. Let's find a good spot. We need to find a, a nice amount of zombies at least to rock it. I guess the cracker book probably respawned by now. Didn't we do it on day one? Certainly. Certainly. It might be fun to blow those up. And then we could get the books from there. All right, all right. That's a possibility. Let me look around for a second. What else could we do? For sure, I don't want to do... Well, can I do a full cracker book at night? That, that seems crazy, right? I only have four rockets. Calm down. Calm down. Let's find something a little bit more feasible. Uh... You know, this might do it. Doesn't look great now. But trust me, this is... Oh, I forgot to put points into parkour. Oh, I really wanted points into parkour. Let's not talk about it. It never happened. We're gonna go over here. I'm sure there's a zombie up here somewhere. And that zombie is going to have a really good time versus me. Yeah, yeah, come down, come down. If you dare. Alright, perfect. And then the rest, I can probably rock it down here. Let's try to make a lot of noise. Wake up, boys. It's go time. And I'm guessing they'll come over here. But worst case scenario, we take off. Come on, man. Yeah, you got this. You got this. There they go. There they go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All of you in the same spot. Well, three, four, it's already worth it, I think. To rock it. Oh, please don't shoot me. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, oh, they didn't die. They didn't die. <gasps> oh my God, that terrified me. But yeah, they died right there. We got them. We got them. Guess the good news is if you do miss, <laughs> you have plenty of shots to make that up. That's beautiful. I think there's a guy on the floor here. I tried to let him out, but he is not having it. Oh my, oh my god. Is this rifle just so much better? See? Even when you miss, everything's alright. The only thing that I need to switch is this here. I'm not gonna need this thing anymore. Unfortunately, it's uh, outlived its efficiency. Now, because I have, you know, everything, I have an auger, I have everything, I could just switch this for an axe, and it would be so much better. That way I can break through wood super fast. Ooh, lucky looter, I'll take. And let's go ahead and wrench these, why not? I've used a lot of components. Not that it matters, really, to be honest. Hello, zombie. Another bed. I need that. 
Um, I know I have lockpicks, but this is dangerous. I'm still gonna do it. Alright, that was absolutely not worth it. <gasps> not worth it. Oh, that little tail counts. Excellent. Oh, nice. An engine. Oh, I will take it. I will take it. <laughs> it's done. The gyro and the 4x4. But since we're going looting, I'm going to go ahead and use the 4x4. It's really close to us. But we are going to use the gyro in the morning. Well, at least when it's light out. So I can actually enjoy it. But in the time being, you know, let's go ahead and fill this up. Can I? Can I? Yes. Refuel. Refuel. Oh my god. He scared me so much. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Refuel. Refuel. This uses so much gas. I'm gonna have to go get a little bit more. Alright, we grabbed a new stack. <laughs> this thing is a monster when it comes to gas. And the lucky looter that we got is find more dukes in loot. Which is going to be pretty nice. Oh yeah, look at me go. Well, with this 4x4, the reason why I want to use it today is because I still haven't worked on the moat, which is probably what I'm going to be working on next. And doing that perimeter is going to be so crazy that I'm, I'm not going to be able to get out with the 4x4 anymore after a little bit. Yeah, we should make it over here and we should be able to loot this place in no time. It is a small, small place. It's like a level 1. We're going in. We're just busting in and hopefully winning. But yeah, the, the reason why I want to wait until the morning to fly around on the gyro is because everything just looks so much more beautiful. It really will. Just trust me. Okay, I thought it was a home, but it was a car lot. It's pretty good. I went ahead and wrenched this car too. But there's so many cars here at the front that we should be alright. I'm going to lay this down. Just in case we do have anything attacking us. But this is good. <laughs> Another engine. Well, well. I guess my electrical is not going to have to wait. I'm very pleased about that. I was a bit worried that with all of this crafting that I wasn't going to be able to work on the electric next, but I am going to be able to. And another corn seed. I mean, my vegetable stew situation is going well. As you can see, I have drank. I've eaten. I am a well-fed lady now. Hello. Day 35. Oh, we're really getting up there. Slowly but surely. This one is just to clear the areas and find supplies. Shouldn't be too difficult, I don't think. But once we actually get in there. And I do have one rocket, though. So... I guess I want to see if I can get them all out here. Right? And actually use it. For all its majesticness. Let's try it. I'm sure there's zombies on the roof. So... We can start with that. Maybe getting them... Uh, how do I do this? How do I do this without absolutely dying? I'll do this. And then we'll do this. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah, we can do this. We'll leave us... No. Well. <laughs> we'll do that. Alright. This works. Okay, zombies, let's get it going. Let's do it. Let's do it. Wakey, wakey. It's go time, please. There we go. I could just save fire in the hole here. Oh, nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> we'll just let them fall out through here, hopefully. Come on, boys. Come on. Do me the favor. There he goes. They're so slow. I need them all to fall. Oh, I don't think they're going to cooperate. Fall through here. Fall through here. Yes. <laughs> right there. Right there. Perfect. Right there, right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Oh, so close. Why are they so stubborn? Okay, okay, okay. 
I'll grab the rocket launcher. We're ready. As soon as I see them. Oh, this is a this is a terrible idea. I'll wait till they come up here at the top. Okay, that's the plan. However many we get, that's however many we get. One would not be pleasing. Well, that guy's gone. Oh! <gasps> How many did I get? Oh my, at least I got two. Or, oh my god. Oh my god, that's so many. We got two. We got two right there. That's good. That's good. Gone. Perfect. Alright, so it wasn't all of them, but a pleasing amount, at least. Whew. Amazing, amazing. I don't think there's any out here. Please get rid of these right away. Oh yeah, and I switched to this. So I don't carry my little hammer anymore. Oh, I'm able to make a better ratchet? Maybe? Question mark? We'll see about that. I know there's some explosives there. Be very, very careful. And let's see what loot we got. I mean, I don't know if we clear the whole area. I think there's still a couple more zombies. Another wheel. <laughs> well, I wish I would have found that one earlier before I did make my vehicles, but it's fine. At the very least, we know we don't need it, so we know we can sell it. Or I can make myself another vehicle, but that, that seems like highly unnecessary. <laughs> let's see what other zombies we're missing. Ooh, 20 repair kits. Jackpot, man. Oh, another lucky looter. We'll take a look to see if they're better than the ones we have. But the ones we have, I think, are close to the best that you can get now. Anything behind? No. Let's see. Plus three. Yeah, they're minus two. Mine, I think, are the best you can get. Plus five must be the best. Let me know if you found a plus six. Like, recently, right? Not Alpha 18... Not even, like, at the start of Alpha 19, just recently. Ever since they did the change to Lucky Looter, have you found one that's higher than plus five? I really don't think so. <laughs> of course, you know, of course. As soon as you don't need it, it's just everywhere. I, I have a backup nail gun now. All right, that's good. Oh, that was close. But look at all this inventory. It's absolutely ridiculous. It's so, so wild. Okay, I'll also put some of these because you don't need that many. That's so crazy. Papaya. Honestly, I feel a lot safer with this, if that makes sense. I don't know if it's necessarily better. Obviously, damage-wise, probably about the same. But I just feel so much safer with it. <laughs> More repair kits. Oh my god. Well, I'm not going to run out anytime soon. That's good. Speaking of repair kits, you know what? Let's just go ahead and repair it so I don't have to worry about it. And now... I'm ready. There's so much more to this place. I thought I was done. Let's close that. Oh my god. Oh, I wish I had the rocket launcher here. But it's such tight quarters. I would have totally died. But four of them... <laughs> I mean, it would have been fun. I love this thing. You shoot so fast. Oh, yeah. The living room is huge. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Uh, repair kits. More repair kits and another engine. Okay. Pump shotgun level 4. That might be better than this for sure. This has 13 damage with a mod. And this is 16. This is much better. Nice upgrade. Really, really nice. I have to check on the leg armor, but all this is really good. We even got a diamond. And another wheel. <laughs> I can't even talk about it. I just made seven of them. <laughs> oh, the timing of that. I should have come here first. And that was the plan originally. To come to one of these places, you know, do a car lot of sorts. I, I wasn't even thinking of this one. I didn't even know this was the quest. But I just thought, oh, I'll do a car lot. But no. Of course not. I was at home and I was like, no, nah, I'm not leaving without it. I'm not leaving without it. That's for sure. Wait, is that something up there? It is. Nice. Oh, okay. It's not exciting, but it's fine. Is there another one? Hello, lady. Goodbye. 
Wow, I didn't even know there was another one here. I, I could have missed that for sure. No loot. <laughs> that was the biggest tease in the history of loot containers. It's almost worse than whenever you loot this and there's nothing in it. 16 repair kits. See, this is a problem. I, we've thought about doing a run with, like, no repairing your weapons or something, or kind of try to nerf it somehow. Or maybe make it so you can't craft your own repair. But you get so many from places like this. It's absolutely mad. Oh, and here's my little box here. My satchel. With a dead body back there. I saw nothing. Now, as you can see, the trader is a mile away. And sure, I could drive there. I could. Could waste most of my day driving there. Or, I could just acknowledge the greatness, the might of the gyrocopter and fly there. Fly for the very first time. So that is exactly what we're gonna do. Here we go. This is actually a pretty easy place to take off from because it has a bit of a, a lip there. So it jumps up, but eventually we'll have a landing pad or a helipad on top of this. It should be pretty good. All right, let's not, let's not fall, let's not fall. I remember how to fly, of course I do. It was my favorite thing to do in Alpha 18, in my Alpha 19 series. This is a game changer. I predict this would probably cut down our travel in half. At the very least, even from the motorcycle. I am pretty sure this is still faster than coming here on a motorcycle. It's just so much better. And not only can you get here super fast, you can see all the PUIs nearby. You can see the whole city. It looks tremendous. Oh, we still need to go to that house. See, it reminds us of things. And it's just idyllic. Right, I'm gonna land. And as you know, I like to jump off right before you land so you don't take any damage. The absolute best. Uh, is this the guy that we need to talk to? Yep, it is. Here we go. As I said, <laughs> don't hold your breath. But at the very least, we get first aid kits, which we could not make otherwise. Let's see if we can take a job from him that wouldn't be too, too bad for next time. Uh, fetch and clear. Seam 400 away. How's Victorian? Uh, could be good, could be bad. Well, we'll figure it out next time. But I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed us finally building these things that we have been working towards basically the whole series. I am a bit of a reckless uh, pilot, I will say. And I just realized that this is in fact permadeath. So me ejecting, ejecting out of this thing would be an absolute, well, it would be, it would be tragic. So I'm going to really try not to do that. I'm also probably going to put some points into parkour that will always, always save me for the most part. Unless I'm flying really, really high. Uh, parkour, if you don't know, you can fall about 100 blocks or so without really dying in general. So it's amazing. It's the best perk. I need to put some points into it if I remember for the next time. This is the dream. I have a rocket launcher. I have a gyro. All is well now. Thanks again for watching. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Until then, bye.